During class closures, local school districts want to make sure kids are still getting the food they count on. Elk Grove schools have fed about 2,000 students this week. CBS 13's Anna Giles shows us how the process keeps students and staff safe. Even though Elk Grove schools are closed right now, there are hundreds of families who need these lunches. Now, let's take a look at how the process works. You can see that a car pulls up, and staff here are handing them boxes of food. Now, this is to prevent people from congregating, prevent crowds from forming in front of the lunches. Health officials are recommending that everyone keep a safe space from each other. Cindy Hernandez has four mouths to feed. The lunch drive through at Florin Elementary is a regular stop for her. Rough. It's scary, overwhelming. Mm -hmm. um, they, of course, they have a lot of questions why they're not in school. With Elk Grove schools closed, she's got to get creative with meals and things to do. It's a lot of extra work for you. Right. Yeah, I have four of them, so. Food Services Director Michelle Drake says dozens of meals are served every day. All my staff are trained um, in food safety, and that includes proper sanitation. And so our food comes from a central kitchen at this point. We're packaging all the meals there, bringing them out to the sites. Drake says many families depend on food service like this to help extend their budget. The same families are most likely the hardest hit by closures due to the virus. For the Hernandez family, it's all about taking the struggle in stride by practicing good hygiene. I'm going to go to the store and I'm like, I'm touching that thing. Um, I actually have my hand sanitizer here. <laughs> and always wash your hands. Don't touch exactly. your face. Now, if these closures continue, families don't have to worry there is still going to be this food service on weekdays.